Okay, it's acting up again. I had it perfect quality. And it stopped being perfect quality on me. Just like YouTube removed the update. It was being awesome. See, look. I swear. The guy who owns YouTube, he'll make things awesome. And people will admit they're awesome. And he'll be like, oh, I better remove those. They're awesome. Oh, what the fudge, dude. I hate the YouTube dudes sometimes. That's serious. I probably get like, blocked for that by all the YouTubers. <laughs> but still, I don't care what trouble I get into saying that. It's true. They're kind of getting annoying now. Not making things work. But, yep, you guys are back to the old quality. I, I didn't plan this. YouTube did it. Somehow, strangely, I was recording my last video. I swear, they make things worse when you admit they're better. It's a thing they have. We call this unperfectness. And by imperfectness, I mean horribly imperfectness. Oh, jigger! That will save me a lot of work if I die. Oh, we're almost on this level. Wow. I think it's taking a lot longer. We only have two more jiggies. Gas are only getting 9 out of 10. Jiggies to get. The next level I dread, cause Bogey pukes up a jiggy and it makes you wanna do it too. Yes, I mean, without the jiggies. It's kinda gross. Watching a guy pick up something to do he's about to eat. It's bird food! Live with it! Live with it! Okay, that was random. Yeah, the next LP I'm doing, I'm not gonna tell you guys. Because it is something you will never ever guess in a billion gazillion years. Especially because I'm doing it blind. Because it's something you would never guess I would be blind. And no, it is not Kirby. It is not even Nintendo, it is not PlayStation, it is not Xbox. It is a um, third party game. It is very unpopular. Probably none of you have played it or even heard of it. I've probably heard of it well, by the same makers, though. One of the same series. But it is very unpopular because of how crappy it is. That's why I'm doing an LP for it. And you must be 18 months or older to play. I'm going to tell you that for sure. It's not going to be almost letter adventure like I did at one time. That game was a glitch, and I'm not going to play it. I got a hacked version from my sister, apparently. Yes, my little sister got it at the store and apparently got it hacked or something. I was so mean of them, but I mean, for a little kid's game, little kids don't play this. Really but no. Uh, you'll see what it is. You guys, you, guys, you guys will like the LP. Because the game uh, promotes no real challenge. And that's funny. Ow! Freaking bugs! That might help us a lot. Looks useless, but it'll help. It'll find its way into our helpfulness charts. Okay, what we're gonna do here. Secret item. A lot of people miss this item. This is the one that's the most missed item in the game. How did you wake up from that? I'm just curious. You didn't even step in the room. That was it. Let us transform! This is the most annoying transformation in the game. I like having the loot jump to get to this one. Wait, my mother more boots. Only kidding. Ha ha ha. Ho 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 ho. That's gonna go. How's it go? I can't remember where to go. It's some team fortress. It's like, oh 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 oh. That kicks me in the guts. Like that. But yes, now we can walk in this annoying water shit. And we're gonna go into this crocodile's nose. I'm scared. We're gonna go into this. <laughs> <coughs> We're gonna go into this nose and get some musical notes. Don't get in this challenge here yet, because we're not ready for that. You're probably saying, what? You just, this is a brand new level, you got everything there is to get here, and you're not ready for it? Yes, we are not. There is an item we will actually not get for two levels that we can't get in there with it. So 
also they they really did some good planning in this part. This part, um, you don't like this whole part here where you have to like wait a few levels so you can actually get all the jiggies. Um, my suggestion, don't buy the sequel because it is full of that kind of shit. Um, it is actually the whole plan of that game is that every level had at least one jiggy that required another level to get unlocked. Whether it be the first level or it be the final level, it will be required that you, um, unlock another level to get it. There we go, got all the jiggies, but we're gonna get the rest of that stuff here. Got all the jiggies, got all the jinjos, got all the hollow honey guns, taking some notes. Let's think of all those with her. Don't need those. Don't waste them. Don't waste it, you don't need it. That's what, uh, Bear Girl says. No. Man vs. Wild is like the best show ever. Don't make fun of it. It's beast. I am missing three notes. Where are you? Come out of hiding, musical notes. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to eat you and the rest of your family. <laughs> Okay, uh, I'm just going to say today. Uh, I think they're right here. Let's see. Yep, there they are. Found them! Okay. Go over there faster, crocodile thing. <laughs> you found all 100 musical notes in this level. Good job. Now we can go back to Grotilda's lair. Where do I go after that? Oh, yeah, freeze DP. That's it. That's it. This is the part where I usually postpone a lot of the LP, but because of the live recording, because the fans like Banjo Kazooie so much, I'm gonna keep going. Um, one thing I like to point out: how the freak was I that convenient? Banjo Kazooie was probably one of the most underrated games in the history of video games. Somehow, everyone I know either plays it or knows what it was. What it is? I'm surprised. And yeah, that's pretty amazing. Uh, even Nintendo can be Sun knows what it is. That's, that, that there is an ultimate game. Chuck a Conroy knows what it is, at least. You have to play it, but he knows what it is. That there is, like, true awesomeness. We are going into zero. <laughs> it's so awesome. It's so awesome, because it is. I like pie and chocolate. Bacon, baby, even pie and cake, but it's a lie. And if anyone remembers, we broke an ice block here, and because we broke it, we can go in. Into a secret area with a super secret bonus item. A cheat code. One of which will double our eggs to 200 at maximum. Oh, Cheeto has double cats. And increasing the maximum eggs you can have, that will probably help the game a lot, be, be easier. Because it will also refill it to 200. And we will find one of the red feathers and gold feathers. They can 50, 100 gold, red feathers and 20 gold feathers. Uh, blue eggs is the code, if you don't know. You, can, you gotta find him first with the code, so I'm just gonna really say it. Uh, a lot of people think you can enter the code wherever you want to. You cannot. My belly is big. It's rather neat. It's been years since I've seen my feet. Uh, no one moon jump in there, by the way, with Banjo. Um, it is pretty cool at first, but once you get in there... Uh, you can't get out. You can't move jump out the ceiling or walls. Cause they did really good programming on that. Make sure move jumpers couldn't get in there. But the outside, you can go in no matter what. I they didn't think of that. And you don't fit through the hole. Yep. Banjo Kazooie being gay for once. You never saw it coming, did ya? Can you believe that ceiling there is? Oh, I never actually looked at this one before. Uh, but yes, if you move jump, you can even walk. It actually is a place where you can walk. If you walk perfectly, you can escape his crocodile will actually roam free with him anywhere you want. Uh, I can show this glitch, but I'm not going to, because it's very, extremely, to be honest, difficult to do. Magic run out. In the next episode, we will open up- oh, we already opened it up. In the next episode, we will explore a little more. Thanks for watching.